guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Yvonne, and today has just been such a fun day. I actually already recorded some things. This is going to be a super fun week. This is the first week of classes. There's also a lot of orientation and Imagine Day going on, and so this year I actually volunteered to be an orientation leader, so I've been doing training all morning, and I did film some of it. I also created little signs for my group tomorrow, so I'll insert all the clips from that after this little introduction video, but yeah, I just wanted to welcome you guys to this video. It's gonna be such a fun week. I'll keep you guys updated. See you soon. Thank you so much. Thank you for like people like you who make it No, you're gonna make me cry. We're gonna start crying together. Oh, you're so sweet. Anyway, you're beautiful. Hope you don't have a bad day. Have a good day. Thank you so much. my orientation purple shirt for arts and I'm about to leave I'm a little bit late this is what it looks like and then the back just has some of my interests and things to ask me about I'll see you guys soon it's now 3 43 p.m. and I've spent my entire day basically just at orientation training and then I got to meet a bunch of second year like transfer students and it was so much fun and we toured them around campus I met so many new people and it honestly feels so good to be on campus like a full campus I and mean, to see people again have social interactions it's so weird but it's a really, really great and exciting feeling. Thank you to every single person who said hi to me today on campus. Shout out to the group of people that came up to me. Thank you for making my day. Everyone I met today was just the nicest bunch of people and it all started with the lady I met this morning at Great Dane. It amazes me how far that kindness can go, so do something nice for someone today. It'll really make their day. I really needed it and someone was there for me. I've taken a mini little break and now I just got redressed. I switched into this really pretty green dress. That's what it looks like. And I'm gonna meet up with my friend Elsa now and go get some food. Let's go see her. So this is day two of me being an orientation leader. Today is actually Imagine Day, so it's supposed to be super exciting. I am again wearing my purple shirt for today, which is the same one I wore yesterday. And I'm gonna head out now and meet the rest of my orientation group, and then I'm gonna meet my students and take them to meet a prof, tour campus, and I hope it's gonna be an amazing day. It's really beautiful out today, so I'm happy. Can't keep my head up off water. Wednesday and the first day of classes 
I'm about to head out to my first class, which is actually Italian 101, and then I have another family studies class after, and I really don't know how I feel if I'm being honest. I'm like really excited, but also really nervous to go back in like an in-person setting and I don't know. I'm just really nervous. I'm really happy. It's super beautiful out today, so I hope we have a nice walk over and I will update you guys because I really don't know how I feel. <laughs> It's now 3.16, I just got back from my first class, which is Italian, and it was just so weird being in a classroom again, and I think I took Spanish for two years in my first and second year, and I was just learning a new language, especially in university, is just very challenging to begin with, so I think being in that room today kind of just brought back those feelings of being super nervous, but we'll see how it goes. I have an hour break before I have another class in Iona building and it's my family studies class which is supposed to be a bigger class. I think there might even be like a hundred people so we'll see how that one goes. I'm feeling really overwhelmed but in a good way. Yeah. If you guys haven't tried their shrimp pad thai, it will be the single thing I recommend to every single person I meet because it is that amazing. I love it so much. One of the people there, Chris, is amazing. He's super nice and I love seeing him. Such a friendly face. So shout out to you, Chris, if you're watching this. Thank you for making my day. I'm going to try to end this because <laughs> I'm so hungry and having this in front of me is just impossible not to eat. So um, I will talk to you guys soon. Hey guys, welcome back to another day. It's Thursday and I can't believe the week's almost over, although it has felt super long. I didn't say goodnight yesterday, but good morning to start off the day. Today what I have planned is that I'm going to do a little bit of work before I head off and do a little photo shoot with UBC for a food thing and then I'm going to meet up with a friend and then we'll kind of see where the day goes. Today we don't have any classes which is really good because I do have a lot of things to catch up on. Um, I am feeling quite overwhelmed for the first week of school but as always I watch my videos back like my first week of classes last year. I'll put in here. But I was feeling the same way where I wasn't very sure of everything, but I think it always happens. I hope I'll get over it, but that's kind of the update where I'm at. I'm also just really tired, but <laughs> don't know if you guys can tell. I'm a little bit dead for nearing the end of the week, but we'll do it. I'm excited for tomorrow too. We have Chat Time's 10th anniversary, which I don't think I told you guys throughout this entire video yet, but I was invited to a chat time 10th anniversary celebration so i'm really excited to go to that and just end off the week with you guys i've had such an amazing week um it's been really good five and I just came back from hanging out with some friends and then going on a walk and then just chilling around my room but now I'm gonna head out to the nest meet up with Michaela and then do more schoolwork. I switched into shorts I don't know if I showed you guys my outfit before but I was wearing jeans so now I'm just doing shorts and this is what it looks like I'll see you guys in a bit
Take a sip from the cup of chess We're both so young And baby, we've got time to face our fears Make our dreams come true We both know what we want And what we've got to do I don't know where the road will go But baby, we can find out If you trust me, you will know It'll all unfold I don't know where the road will go But baby, we can find it You can find that part of gold Find that part of gold Find that part of gold People talk or people talk They don't like what we have got Oh, baby, you and me Hey guys, I am done on my classes today. I really only had one because what happened was I took Italian. You guys came to class with me on Wednesday and then I just felt honestly pretty overwhelmed and it's supposed to be in my elective so it's supposed to be fun and all and if I'm not having fun, I think I should switch a course. So that's what I did this morning and I switched into creative writing. It's like 250 people but it's all online and I literally secured the last spot. Like it was so full, I was refreshing it every like hour or so and I finally got a spot so I'm super happy we're done for the week basically after my film class this morning I just went to this building called Iona and I just sat there and drew a little picture and a little note for the lady the very sweet lady that gave me free coffee at the start of this video the start of this week and really just shifted everything for me I was having a really hard time just transitioning back to being in Vancouver after being home and so she really helped me with that an absolute angel and so I thought I'd say thank you somehow. So then after that, I went to the nest a little, and now I'm back home. And I'm just kind of chilling around before I go to the chat time event. This is the first ever event I've been invited to, and I'm just super, super excited for that. And it's also really beautiful out, so I'm just really happy and really excited. And I'm happy that I get to take you guys along and that I'm filming this week. The Cha Time event is located at the Moon and Back Gallery in Richmond, BC. And it's it has almost, I think there's like 10 or 11 rooms with all like cute lights and stuff. It's basically for you to just walk around and take photos in. And because it's Cha Time's 10th anniversary, I assume they're going to have like a room with like bubble tea and stuff and like free drinks. So I'm just honestly really excited to be there. Like what this is a big day for me but anyways i will see you guys when i'm finished getting ready and yeah hi guys it's almost go time i'm actually really excited with my outfit i currently have on a black top and then i put a blazer over it and then i put a black skirt with chunky black boots i'm actually so excited for this event maybe it's because it's also friday that i'm like super super excited I don't know, but I'm just really happy right now, and I really like this outfit. I think it's really cool. I've never really worn anything like this out, so this will be fun. We're going to meet Michaela soon and then head over, so catch you guys there. Don't it feel like a drug? 
Welcome home. It's now like 9 30 or so. Michaela and I just bust back and I'm just in such a good mood. I honestly am. I'm so thankful. I'm so happy for this entire week. So much has happened. Being an orientation leader to the garden party to this event. Like it's been such a week. Probably the most eventful week I've had honestly in quite a while. But yeah, I'm just feeling very grateful and and what? They gave me a gift bag, so happy. Uh, they gave me a t-shirt. Yeah, let me show you guys what's in it because I'm very excited. They gave me a t-shirt, the Moon and Bat Gallery. They also gave another white one. They gave moon cakes, which I am really excited to eat because I can't remember the last time I've had it. And then they gave me this glass little cup and straw. We also have, oh, to carry like bubble tea with and then a little pamphlet. And then a free drink, what? I'm honestly, if you can't tell, I'm like really excited. And the fact that I even got to go to this, like, what? I'm not gonna ever get over this. Um, I'm just gonna go be really happy off camera now. Just know that this week has been so wild for me, like literally so wild. <laughs> also the first week of classes, just seeing how many people are back on campus is just both overwhelming and exciting for me. This is my last term at UVC and I hate to say that, but <laughs> it is what it is. I am trying to make the most out of my last four months and record every single moment for you guys and for myself to watch back. So I'm really happy I got to record the first week of my classes and all these amazing events and people. It's just been so much. I will stop blabbering. I don't know why I'm so like hyper right now, but thank you so much if you watched up to this point. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to see some pictures or more pictures from this week, you can check out my Instagram somewhere here. And yeah, I will see you in my next video. Peace.